Good afternoon. Welcome to the Midday Mall for Thursday, the 4th of April. With Robert Murray McShane, we have begun reading Paul's first letter to the Thessalonians. And in chapter 1, verse 2, he says the following, We always thank God for all of you and continually mention you in our prayers. Just an encouragement to keep praying and thanking God for the people around about us. But then he continues and says, We remember before our God and Father your work, produced by faith, your labor prompted by love, and your endurance inspired by hope in our Lord Jesus Christ. And then he goes on and says that their Christian faith and the example of their Christian faith shines brightly in the world and many people speak about what they do. And as I read that, I thought it's, it's, it's quite different to so much of what we think today, where we think faith is something that I believe, it's something internal, it's uh, I love in my heart. It's, it's, it's all internal. Whereas Paul's saying that they, he, he saw the work produced by their faith, the labor prompted by love, and the endurance inspired by hope. He could see what the Thessalonians were doing, what their faith produced in their actions, in their lives. And that for us, that, that's a challenge, that our faith needs to shape our lives. And it is also interesting as you read that, he doesn't say, I thank God for the testimonies you give. I thank God for all the words you speak. I thank God for the stories you tell. I thank God for your proclamation of your faith. No, no, no. He's saying for what you do. It is seen in your actions, in your lives. And as I was th <laughs> thinking about that, just immediately, uh, Jesus' words uh, to us, let your light shine before people, that they will see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. And our Christian life needs to uh, be lived in a world that needs hope and light. And we're not called to take lots and lots of words. We're called to live out our, our, our love and our hope and our, our joy. <laughs> we, we need to have work. We need to have labor. We need to have endurance, as Paul says here. So be encouraged that... that um, Faith shapes our lives, and we don't have to say too much about it. We've just got to pray that, that our lives will be such that people see God in us. So be challenged, be encouraged, and know that as we live that, we are blessed. And then just a note that I will be going on leave for a week, so there will be no midday miles from tomorrow for the next <laughs> while. Um, and we'll pick it up again in about Monday, two weeks' time. So... Remain in God's presence, hold on to his word, and know that we are blessed.